Hello, this is Teacher Jekka of Chemglish.com. I am here to guide you in studying the book Journey to English by Degu English Village. This book contains a lot of interactive situational role plays with native English speakers to enhance your communication skill. In this video, we are going to begin with Unit 5. Unit 5 is entitled Bank. In Unit 5, we are going to learn these things. First, we are going to learn the kind of denominations of U.S. coins and bills. Also, we are going to learn how to open an account at the bank. And to deposit and withdraw money from your account. Now, I'll show you the page. In the first page of Unit 5, we are going to define a lot of words, places, and things that you will encounter when you're at a bank. As you can see, all of the things have numbers. Now let's begin with number 1. This person is called a security guard. A security guard is someone whose job is to guard a place. Number two, this is called an exchange display. It shows the exchange rate of different currencies. Number three, this machine is called an automated teller machine. It lets you withdraw your money from the bank. Four, this person is called a teller. It is someone whose job is to receive and pay out money in a bank. Picture number five, these are bills or notes. These are paper money. Number six, these are coins. Coins usually have lower amount or smaller amount than paper money or than bills or notes. Now let us define each of the coins below. Number seven, this coin is called a penny. It's a small coin in the United States and it's worth one cent. Number eight, this coin is called a nickel. A nickel is a coin that is worth five cents and it's made of silver metal. Number nine, this tiny coin here is a dime. A dime is a coin worth 10 cents in the United States and Canada. Number 10, this coin is called a quarter. A quarter is worth 25 cents. Now let us proceed to number 11. Object number 11 is a bank book or in British, it's a pass book. It's a small book showing the amounts of money that you put into and take out of your account in a bank. Thirteen, this part of a passbook is called balance. It's the amount of money you have in your bank account. Twelve, number twelve is account number. An account number is found in your bank book and is very important to know when sending or receiving money. Number 14, this is called an ID or identification card. When going to a bank, it's very important to bring an identification card to prove your 
identity. Object number 15 is called a check book. It's a book of printed paper that you can use instead of money to pay for things. And those are called checks. 16 is insert. Insert is to put something inside. On the other hand, number 17 is take out. Take out is to remove or get something out of a machine. Now we have additional words below. Number 18, open an account. Open an account. It means if you have an account with the bank, you'll leave your money there and take some out when you need it. Number 19 is deposit. To deposit is to put the money into your bank account until you need it. The opposite of deposit is withdrawal. It's to take out money out of your bank account. Lastly is PIN or personal identification number. It is a private number for security reasons. I hope that you have taken note of their definitions because these words are useful when uh, you're at a bank. I hope that you have learned something from this video lecture brought to you by chemglish.com. Have a good day.